So what I'm going to do here is talk through the crazy stuff that um, Black Eagle done. Um, you guys saw the video, well about, I don't know, over a hundred views on that video now. Um, and uh, yeah, so just to give a bit of background <coughs> to the video. Okay, so what was it? It was back in uh, February the 12th. To, uh, yeah, February 12th, okay. Um, getting on to Black Eagle's realm, and this is when we just got back into realms uh, and uh, went into Minecraft forums, saw Black Eagle's advert for his realm and some other people's, like Realm of Montrose by Dr. Mr. Chicken, or was it Mr. Dr. Chicken? Um, so, yeah, he like asks, How old am I? Time zone, how active, all that. I give him the details, tell him that we've got a YouTube channel, and he goes, the realm is not always active, but if you are with a group of friends, that isn't going to be a problem then. Can I have all your IGN names? You are all welcome. So I give him all our names. Uh, and he goes, hmm, NP, uh, no problem. Together we can build up an, a community that's bigger than all of us. When are you guys able to join? So he's really eager to get us all on. Um, and I'm like, okay, I might be on a little bit later. Uh, this is the second, uh, this is on the 12th of February and I said my friends will be on later which is about three hours plus I didn't even know what where he is, what his time zone was no problem, you got all the time you need I gave you guys a location so you got all the spice you need to play, welcome I don't know what a Belgian accent is, I don't know what this guy's voice is so I'm just putting a different voice for him okay Van Damme well, well, Van Damme, I can't do a Van Damme. Well, you don't have to do that anymore. I'll just put that silly voice on. So, oh yeah, so I'll go, yeah. Uh, so he put on a welcome sign, you know. And it was very nice. He gave us a nice... I mean, you saw the Black Eagle Realm videos. There's about three of those on our YouTube channel. He gave us a nice beachfront place next to a ship. Uh, and we were nicely settled. We liked it. It was... Um, fun we, it was nice of him it, it seemed so far um, and he goes yeah so you're one of us there and I'm like brilliant looking forward to checking out your realm over the week because um, yeah I wasn't really playing much I was busy uh, and then I ask uh, I was wondering how many blocks are the uh, nearest player you know made settlements that you know of and he's like, I don't know, man, everyone is spread. But far enough, there were some griefers before, that's why we did that. Now everyone is checking their chests and stuff, so I hope that griefing stops. And yes, the griefers are banned. So, like, immediately you think, oh, okay, he's a good guy. He really doesn't like griefers. And I'll just say, griefers perhaps lack imagination and don't respect creativity. Indeed. So, he's just building rapport. Making it seem like, you know, he's the vic he's been a victim of griefing. Um, so anyway, you know, at the time I thought, oh, okay, cool, this guy's safe, you know, it's nice. N no, nothing off-putting yet. Uh, but then he, what was it, it's the next, so that was the 12th, and then on the 17th. Why do you always join for two minutes and then leave, lol? You are here for a bit now, but the only thing you made is a campfire. No hate. I'm like, what the hell is it to you, man? It's like been a few days. What you, it's like chill man what the hell is it to you I'll build stuff when I want but anyway I was like oh you wait and see we've got a nice surprise for you you know he said oh what are you planning and I said it's a surprise a big project I was like I, I don't get why he was asking me I just found it a bit nosy but you know I thought okay he's been so nice just play with it and I said look it'll be maybe a month's work I mean it might take a week to get all the resources uh, and I said you know I'm looking to make a nice base of operation and I said look have you seen any of our YouTube videos you know because I was like if you saw them he'd know what we're like I don't know why he's needing to ask these questions because on Realm of Montrose uh, Dr. Mr. Chicken he was he never bothered anyone and he, you know I never got to ask these questions and he's like asking what a big quack uh, town or something like that and I just ignored him uh, I didn't answer that question <clears throat> and then the next day he's asking again what my question is, why didn't you start building and stuff? You got great plans and stuff, go for it. And I'm like, what, what? you know, it's just like every day, it's been three days now, it's constantly messaging about what am I doing, am I building, where am I? Uh, so I'm like, look, I work home from home, my schedule is all over the place, so when I get time, free time, I try to make the most of it. Okay, cool. 
and then um uh okay so then i ask how far are people traveling on this road like 10,000 blocks from zero zero or 20,000 and not with Neverpool, you know, I was just want to know how far people have travelled on this realm. And he goes, I don't want people to travel that far, because it produces lag. And explored land will not be updated. Why did people even travel so far? There is nothing cool yet. So, like, that's a load of bullshit, you know. <laughs> I was on Realm of Montrose. There's, like, a lot of times, ten people always online. Loads of things happening, farms, everything. And you get a little bit of lag, and no one complains about it. And this guy's hardly, ha it, it wasn't an active realm. Uh, us guys were the most active people on it. And so, it was making a big deal, like, uh, so I was like, why doesn't he want us to explore? And I'm telling him, you know, that's what my experience is, but he's like, uh, he just keeps, every time new chunks load, uh, they won't be updated. If you want to travel 10,000 blocks, this is not the right realm. But I hope you stay, of course. Like, what the hell? <laughs> and I'm like, okay, I won't do that again, no worries, sorry about that. Whoosh, and I was like, okay. But then, um, I just thought, you know, we just started, so I didn't want to rock the boat, but I just thought, found it annoying. And so, yeah, he adds Poe and Doctor. And then, okay, so it's now the 23rd, and it's like, um, maybe we should start, we should plan an event together. And I was like, yeah, we're up for that, you know, what you have got in mind. And then he asked me, you got an idea? Like, Sh what the hell are you talking about? It's your bloody realm, you're asking me for an idea. <laughs> like, yeah, you should, you should have told him that, let's play a game that we can face. <laughs> so, <laughs> I'll say that again, Doctor, I didn't hear that, sorry. <laughs> you should have suggested to him that we play a game where let's punch your face in. All right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so, yeah. So anyway, he's, um, so I said, okay, let, let's organize it for next Friday. It's a bit too soon. You can't just do it now. Uh, and I thought, okay, maybe some like releasing the wither. Cause you know, you, you guys, if you watched our YouTube channel, we've got like a series on when we tried to take on the wither, wither for the first time last year. So I thought, okay, that'd be nice to try that again. And that was fun for us, team building and all that. <clears throat> but he's like, I want you guys to build up a big kingdom that will stay forever and maybe indeed spawn the wither and hang out together. Did you tell your friends the update exploring thing? Like, what the? F and I'm like, update exploring thing? Nope. Uh, and I said, yeah, they've been chatting with Bad Biscuit. They discussed, discussed some ideas together. And I've ignored the thing about the exploring thing. I just didn't answer that. <clears throat> So now, three days later, on the 26th, he's like, Sabuka, I would like to have a ev war event if you want, just for fun. A big war event. Maybe we can both think about in the concept. Now, what the hell is like, and I'm like, okay, don't you have these mini games that you could play in Realms? Why didn't you do that? And he goes, no, not a mini game. It's a bit more serious than that. May just maybe buildings that people can take over. So I'm like, okay. But anyway, he brings up again about the traveling. It's like, but Tsubuka, do your friends know that they need to, they don't need to travel away 10,000 blocks uh, cause of the lag and because of the updates? And I'm like, okay, look, we're not traveling up far. We got the village. That's all we need. Yeah, so we found a local village and that's as far we were going at the time. <clears throat> um, I mean, we were exploring. I mean, I, sp I explored the shit out of that realm. I found a nether portal. I like, found, I realized that he was pretending that this was a new realm. You know, even on the Minecraft forum, who was advertising some threads, a new forum, uh, a, a new realm. And it wasn't, because I found why he what, didn't want us to explore. There was, like, huge uh, things, like, thousands and thousands of blocks all across the realm. Things that had been built yeah, up. There was, a, <coughs> there was a nether portal that led right to his base. Above. Yeah. And in the nether, they had built the nether up. So in the nether, they had all these, like, uh, tunnels of ice with boats going really far that it even took some time on these boats on ice at maximum speed to get from one end to the other he they you know so there's a lot out there so i'm like so i explored around yeah <laughs> when he wasn't online and um if he came, because he'd tp to you to find out where you are so if he if i saw that he came on i'd just log off <laughs> i just don't want him to you know find out that i'm sneaking around but you know it's just so that's what he's doing so um Again, he wants, so now it's the next Friday, you know, he wants this event to happen. And he's like, oh, why don't you start a YouTube series? 
in a few years when the realm is big, we can all see those things again. The different walls, different people. And I'm like, yeah, okay. I intend to do some recordings, you know, la di da. And um, when are you guys ready for lot war? Now, this is February 28th now, and we've gotten peed off. So I write him a long message. Listen, Mr. Black, I'm not sure what you expected of us, but my guys do their own thing. So do I. And whenever we agree to do something, we do it. But we don't always agree. That's just how we work. Sometimes we have chemistry and sometimes we don't. But we're grown working men, some of us married, some of us with children. Now that's none of anyone's business. We keep real life out of Minecraft and stay anonymous. However, I'm only st stating those things because I'm not always obvious. It's not always obvious when we are playing with teenagers or with young adults. And we are not young, so we don't have the same attitude to gaming. And we like to relax and just chill really. And my guys love to explore. So it seems counterintuitive to us to be on a realm but not to be able to explore due to lag. And I told him about the other realm again, you know, we don't have any of that issues. Um, and I asked him, why don't you have rules? So I'll show him a picture, a screenshot of, um, yes, Mr. Dr. Chicken on Realm of Montrose. And he has like a, he has the rules stated. And this bloody uh, Black Eagle doesn't do that. And I kept on asking a few times and he wouldn't. Um, he just ignore me. But I wrote a big thing and he's like, oh, wow, that's a lot. What's your big point actually? Can you say it shortly? And I'm like, well, he's not going to even read our complaints because we were getting peed off with him spying on us doing all sorts of things uh, the restrictions and all this weird stuff he was doing and saying and I'm just saying look well my guys we like to explore freely if and when we like because otherwise they're not going to stick around here if they're being told where they can and can't go because then what else are they meant to do on this realm that's worth their while and that's the same goes for me by the way and then it's like um, uh, what do you think to find if you go 10,000 blocks away? It makes no sense, my friend. And I'm like a friend of his right now. And I'm like, we don't know what we will find. That's the point, idiot. We like to just explore and be surprised by the randomly generated world. And the idiot is still not getting, it's not getting through to him. So it's like, oh look, we're going to talk about it after the event, okay? But just stay home, okay? So now I'm thinking, what is this event? I think the event was what he did in the video that we uploaded before. That's, that was the bloody event, what he was going to do, is just pull something silly like that on us. Um, uh, yeah, and um, but he's telling us, oh, before, just stay home, okay? So he doesn't want to discuss about this exploring stuff, and he's not going to need to after this event thing bullshit. So, okay. Um, oh yeah, here's the other thing. He's having these discussions about an event, and he's just doing it with me on Discord. He's, he's got his own Discord server channel for the whole realm. We're not discussing it there. And I'm like, why not discussing it on there with everyone else? And we're also talking in-game, not just on Discord here. And I couldn't get, why has it been so funny? He's not, um, he's not, a. Uh, why is there a bloody zombie in here, Doctor? Never mind, okay. Okay. So, yeah, so, <laughs> okay, thank you, Doctor. So, yeah, the, he's, the Black Eagle is not having the discussions with anyone else, just me. So then in-game, I'm asking other people, and I'm meeting other players, and they had some interesting stories. They're, like, getting peed off with, like, um, yeah, these unannounced events they pull sometimes. And I'm like, what do you guys do? Oh, we just ignore him. And then what really got me is one of the guys said, um, once he reset the realm without notice, I was like, you what? What do you mean? And... Yeah, he never said any of this, and um, also some people were saying, no, it's, this realm is older than six months, I already knew that because I explored around. So he's been saying different stuff to different people, and he's been lying to us. And I'm like, what is this game? So, you know, I always give benefit of the doubt, I always think that, you know, good nature will impact others and, you know, rub off. But this, sh you know, I'll save the words for later. <laughs> so, okay, so he's like, okay, yeah. Um, okay, I got it, but I want everyone online for the event. Okay, I don't want, I don't even know what country you're in, you know, where UK GMT time, when, when you want it. And he's like, okay, I want an hour so everyone can come. And I'm like, look, my guys are already on the realm. Where are you? Where's everyone else? Oh, and I want you too. Okay, I'll be around. And he's like, Zabuka, man, I need your help. Are you around? And I'm like, poet and the doctor are on the realm. 
I need some help. I found a way, Zubuka, to make the realm free. But I'm going to need your help now. I'll tell you soon, but you need to get on now. Everyone is coming on. We need you now. Zubuka, we are waiting. And I just ignored him. And that was, what, 11.28 p.m. on the 28th of February. Like, I mean, we'll find out later what the hell he's talking about, making the realm free. He pulled the shit on someone else. So I ignore him. And then, what time is it? Then on the ne- uh, March, the f- so I, yeah, I just, what happened was the Friday came, he didn't do anything, no one else was there, the poet and doctor were there doing their own shit, you know, what they needed to do, but there was no Black Eagle, there was no event. And then he tries it again the next Friday, I'm like, what the hell is this, and I'm like, in game I talked to him, what happened? You said there was going to be an event, well, why, you know, what's going on? Oh no, no, I'll do it this Friday, I'm like. So I'm like, okay, I'm tired of this, you know. Are you going to do that game? Okay, I'm either on or I'm not. But I'm not, you don't count on me being there just because of your bloody event that doesn't happen. So, you know, I got riled up. And then I was just playing on Realm, Realm of Montrose more because I just got peed off with him. And he keeps on TPing to you and asking you, what are you doing? Where are you going? And I'm like, I'm like bloody mind your own business, man. And he was doing this to me, to Poe, to Doctor. And I was finding out other players, asking them, does he do this to you? Yeah. And uh, Willow C, or Cyan James, he left the realm. And we didn't know why, but I later found out, yeah, he, he was he found out stressful. And I don't know what else he'd done to him. Um, so, yeah, he keeps on. Uh, uh, and then, what, where are we now? <coughs> and then on March the 7th, he asks, can I maybe come into the videos? It's nice to have it as a reminding of the years. I'm like, okay, of course, man, yeah, wherever. Um... And then again, another Friday comes, and I'm like, just ignore him. And then it's what, March the 14th. Zabuka, I used to do with us, man. And I'm like, uh, give us some time, man. Life doesn't revolve around Minecraft. Hey, easy, understood? I was just asking something. Take tour time, you're welcome. And then it's like uh, March the 15th, he messages good, I ignore him. And then it's April the 13th. And this is when the shit goes down. Because obviously he's seen that we're playing on Cozy Realm and Realm of Montrose. Because we've got the YouTube videos out there. And I've, you know, us guys, we got fed up of him. <coughs> but we wanted him to change. Because he he's still doing his own shit. And we wanted him to... He wasn't listening to me. He didn't put the rules up. Uh, little things that we asked for, he didn't do. So we just had enough. And he kept on doing the shit behaviour that was just peeing us and other people off. So anyway, what happens is... Um, uh, so then, okay, this is April the 13th, 13th, hi, how are you, I have awesome news, I think we have a win-win situation here, and I'm like, win-win, as in like, Stephen R. Covey's seven habits of highly effective people, win-win, fourth habit, glad you got some, <laughs> glad you got some awesome news, nothing awesome, but just all striking the death toll, you know, I was, I was like, you know, just, uh, bringing in the role events of like, you know, I'm glad you got awesome news. Everyone else is dying around in the world. And it's like, exactly, ha ha, you know. Well, I'm working in a media center now. And I may promote some low YouTube channels. So what that means, I can make a channel up to 10,000k plus subs in some days. Give a big fan base. You are a hard worker. And I respect that. I know, like, what the fuck is it going on about now? <laughs> so I'm like, okay, media center. I don't know what that exactly is. So I'm like, I just played dumb. So I'm like, I don't know what that is exactly. I thought it was something that you hook up to, all your media up to at home. But I really admire, and appreciate this kind gesture. And then he gets down to business. Tell me if you are in. But number one, if you are in, you're gonna be famous in no time. So if you can't handle that, I suggest you don't start it. Two, you need to follow some instructions without trust. This can't work. Three, that's it. And I'm like, fame doesn't matter us. Us three guys are anonymous. I made sure of that for myself. Following instructions, yeah. As long as they're simple, I could do that. All right, whatever, man. Pardon me. It is simple. So first of all, I'm going to make some commercial videos. I'm going to need your Minecraft account for some hours. Why the fuck do you need my Minecraft account for this? 
Change the password after if you want. When it's edited, in a few days I'm gonna start making posters, etc. If that is done, I'm gonna do whatever I can to make our project work so we can maybe be on TV for some second Belgium. What the f <laughs> So he's got this new job in something called a media center in Belgium and he's claiming he can get us TV airtime. How much bullshit can you take, doctor? Haley, you listening to this? How much bullshit can you take? So the bottom line is he's a social, 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 engineer, social engineer, right? He's trying to get your password for your Minecraft account. Yeah. Doing a shit job of it as well. <laughs> and he's been trying to do it to other players too. Not just, uh, not just you. For how many years, we don't know. And I'm like, ooh, that's a lot of trust. How many years? 15 years. <laughs> 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 So he's like, 15 years. <laughs> so he's, um, 15, 15 years and then he fell off. <laughs> I'm dickless now, so I'm just, <laughs> so now, <laughs> so now I just. Yeah, so Black Eagles, you're a wanker. Yeah, and, but, 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 but then it fell off, but now it fell off, now he just has to, you know, he just plays with Stanimans, and Stanaman is his prosthetic anus. <laughs> you know, so that's how it works. So, um, so let's get back to this, man. I'm almost at the end of it. So, that's a lot of trust. I say it's on you, man. I'm like, what do you get out of it? Out of what you said it's win win. So, I'm supposed to win subs and views. What do you win? Without a lot of luck, I get good impressions for the job. I want to just help you out because you didn't leave the realm. You are always such a nice dude. And I'm like, why are you trying to flatter me? Such a nice dude, aren't you? Nope, lol. I know I'm not the nicest dude, and you have always stayed calm and respectful. You are the man. Okay, so he knows he riles people up. And other people haven't been respectful. But anyway, this guy's proper putting on the flattery on. And that pisses me off when people do that. Because it's just, it's just us. When people flatter you, you know they're up to shit. <laughs> you know. And if, you've, if, if you're a sucker for flattery, you've got low self-esteem. You know, tell yourself that. You don't need anyone's flattery. So I'm like, okay, Bastard. yeah. <laughs> so I'm like, Black Eagle, I don't know what to make of you, lol. And he's like, ha ha ha, finally, someone that comes with the truth. I'm like, truth, you're a fucking shit, you know what to talk about. And I'm like, okay, look, I'm like, I could add you like an editor with some rights on the new YouTube channel. And I'm like, sure, no problem, but I still don't know. Are you in? I'm like, what the fuck are you in? I still don't get what you're saying it in. As you can see from my YouTube account, we're noobs. That's the whole point. From noobs to a successful channel. That's my project. You still haven't made clear what you get out of it. Why are you making such an effort for us? If I can... Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, not, not the Michael Jackson that everyone respects, but the creepy shit. That's who I'm, 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 I'm channeling him through Black Eagle. Yeah. If I can prove... I can boost people from zero to hero. I can get a promotion, maybe. And they are looking for people like me. I only need to have a project, got it? But you don't need to do this if you don't have to, bro. No problem. If you do, just trust me for some hours. That's all. You know what? It is sounding like that pervert. The pervert version of Mark Jackson. I just need you to trust me for some hours, uh, Macaulay. Just come into my office. <laughs> Give me your... <laughs> uh, anyway... <clears throat> So I ignored the shit again, and that was at, what, 11.51pm, and look at this, 11.51, the very next day, 8.46, who the fuck, 8.46, the next morning, he's apparently in Belgium, I'm sure they have a lockdown, he apparently got a new job, he's working there, he's looking to get a promotion, like, what the fuck, 8.46, he's asking me, good morning, how's life? I had a great night full of motivation. <laughs> <laughs> wanking, wanking, Mr. Stanner Tan, Stanner Man Tan. You know, you know, you know, he wasn't just wanking, he was wanking. What was it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. So, anyway, his. Uh, we know what kind of videos he wanted to 
wanted to make of you, mate. <laughs> so I'm like, I'm not letting you onto my YouTube channel, man. That's my responsibility. I am just desperate for views and subscriptions. They either come or they don't. That's not in my power. What's in my power is what I upload. And I upload whatever I want. We do things for ourselves, what not for others. And to be honest, I'll be crazy to let everyone have my credentials. I'll be a complete idiot. Idiot. I'm trying to remain anonymous. You know, what the hell? And this working for some media center, this getting a promotion by promoting someone else's work rather than your own work or your employer's work. And I'm like, I've managed projects in my time with put people working under me, just so you know. I'm just putting it out there, you know, I've called him bullshit, you know, this is total bullshit. I'm trying to... And he's like, the only thing you need to do is changing your Minecraft email address for some minutes. That's not a big deal, man. In life, you need to take risks or you will forever stay a noob. Your words. I'm giving you a chance. What do you think? I'm gonna keep your Minecraft account like an eight-year-old kid? Come on. I can't even do that because you only need to change the email. So let's do this so I can prove myself. What the fuck? So how about you making us operators on your realm? We promise it would be amazing. An amazing opportunity. We could do as much as you could not imagine. Answer remains no. I don't know what you want. My, you know, I'll tell him to, I'm just telling him no. And he's like, so you don't trust me? You don't want to work with me? But I should make you operator? First April is already passed this year. I don't want access to your YouTube channel. I never said that, you fuck you, you did. You need to change your Minecraft email address. That's it. Why exploding it? Change my Minecraft email? What's that got to do with my YouTube channel? Change my Minecraft email to what? You mean the one I log into Minecraft with? Yep, that's it. It's one big misunderstanding, lol. Sounded like fucking Trump now. You know, just a moment ago saying he wants a YouTube account, you know, promoting that. Now he wants me to, wants me to give up my bloody, um, Minecraft account to him. So, yeah, it goes on and we're like, we're going to and fro, um, feigning ignorance. He gives his email address, studiobelu at uh, gmail.com. I'm just highlighting here so you can guys see. That's the email address, yeah? I don't know how many he got, but that one, just fuck that one up. Fuck it hard. So, no. Um, so yeah, I'm pretending I don't know how to do this. Help me, give me screenshots, you know, send me links, and he's like helping me, you know, helping me out, do this stuff. And I'm like, look, uh, why don't you just down? And he's like saying, look, I don't, uh, I don't know. Wait, wait, I missed a bit. He wants to give up the realm. So now it's not about promoting my thing. He wants to give up my, uh, the realm. He can't take it anymore. I'm like, what the fuck? Why does he want? I don't want your realm. Uh, he like he, so he's changed the story again. Um, I'm like, look, why don't you just download the world map, share it out, then people can just restart the realm with that map. I'm not inter interested in continuing a realm that has already been overdeveloped. And right now we're on cozy realm, and we, you know, we're enjoying it there. <coughs> um, yeah, so like, ha! <laughs> oh my god, man! In the most friendly way, what is your problem? So the whole day, no, three days he's been going on about this. So it's now, what, 12 p.m. Tuesday. And he's like, what is your problem, man? I am trying to do something good here. And all I get is shit over my face. We shouldn't put your face near Stanaman's ass so much. And 1,000 words of why and how. I am on a point in my life to hang myself. All I want to do is doing good for people. Just let me help, that's it. Not a big deal. And only some minutes, I don't see the problems, I don't see it. I'm like, I'm fucking hell, man. <laughs> so I'm like, you know, I've worked in mental health. Uh, and I'm like, okay, if he's talking suicidal, okay. That, I was like, okay, that explains it. Why so badass, batshit crazy. He's got some, he really has got real problems. So I'm like... Look, more, I'm more concerned about your life than Minecraft or all this realm shit. You know, just like, what's going on in your life? And then he flips it. Well, if you accept my gift and trust me, I am trust you enough to tell you my life story. If you want to hear that, of course, I just can't handle this. And, you know, la la la. Yes, I got it. I want to talk to you. I want to talk with you about it. But can you just take it over? Because it's giving me stress. I can't explain it. You don't have to lose anything. Let's solve this. And then I really want to talk with you. You understand me anyway. And I'm like, why do you have so much on this realm? Why so much emo emotion attached to you? What the hell's going on, man? I'm like, it's bloody hell, man. Yeah, so I'm like, look, let it go, man. And like, and he's saying, oh, I'm stretching it out. I'm like, I'm not stretching it out. You do that to yourself. I do whatever the hell I want. You can still choose how it impacts you emotionally. It's my body. I 
<laughs> if I say how to change your email, would you help me out? Yes, super good. I know it got a str I got a sp stress problem. You're the only one that knows that actually. Even my own family doesn't know. Oh, sob, sob. <clears throat> and I'm like, okay, look, show me screenshots how to do this. Okay, goes on and like on. Okay, again, show me how to do this login and like. So what I'll do, I'll make another email account. Uh, a Mojang account with that and I and I say okay I'm gonna change it to this email that you wanted and he's like oh no is this not your actual Minecraft account with the game in it and I said no hell no I'm not gonna give you that and he's like well I need that and I'm look if you're giving up playing Minecraft give your bloody you, you don't need me <laughs> you know why don't you just put put your Minecraft account and your Rome everything on it if you're giving it up and I just realized wait wait why don't you change your email account to me, why am I having to change my account to you? You know, and I like you change your story from YouTube channel to getting me lots of subscribers, and now you want to, get, you know, my Minecraft account, and now you're saying you want to give up the realm, and then he makes some shit about his sister, if he has one, his older sister who's like some whiz kid who can like uh, make it free for him. I remember way back that first time he said we've got to get in line. I found a way of making the realm free. So now he talks about that, he's saying his sister's found some way of making it work. Because I obviously found out there is no way you can transfer realm ownership like that. You know, the way he's talking it. So he obviously just wants my account to take over it. Um, <clears throat> so anyway, it goes on, goes on. I'm like, say, look, it can't be done. And he's like, no, no, my sister's a genius, she can do it. And I'm like, look, I know Java programming, I know you're talking a lot of bu bullshit. It's not possible. And then he gets peed off because now it's Tuesday at 3 p.m. It's been long enough. He's tried his hardest. And what he does, he he blocks me on Discord. I'm like, what the fuck? And he friends me. Look, if I hang myself, it's on you. And I'm like, well, if you hang yourself, you don't even know me. And I don't even know you. And, you know, so that's the end of the Discord. He's blocked me. So then I go onto the realm. And that's what you see of the video. You know, you see... <coughs> of the video uh, with um, I'm just playing the video now guys uh, if you can see it uh, poet uh, and uh, the doctor on the stream so yeah so what so what we had planned poet doctor and thingy while we were peed off and we were like we were planning on leaving this realm anyway because we got happy with cozy and he was being a dick and we're thinking, oh, do we just leave our stuff? And we're like, no, we want to destroy the stuff. Burn it, uh, get some TNT. But we couldn't even be bothered to, like, uh, harvest enough TNT to blow it up. But, um, so I was, like, panicking. Oh, shit, shit, shit. I, I still got access to the realm, so I'll get on the realm. He's not on yet, but I started recording as soon as he came on. I was thinking, how am I going to do this? i got to burn this. How do I blow this all up? Because we don't want to leave it for him. You know, it's our work. Uh... And then he makes out, he comes on and he makes out, why did you block me on Discord? And I'm like, I didn't block you, you blocked me. Again, this bloody shit that he does. And um, and then uh, his uh, pros prosthetic ass came, Stanaman 10, who I didn't know was in on it. You know, Stanaman had been sort of like, hadn't been an ass at all. It always been Black Eagle, so I didn't know. Stanerman was his pros prosthetic ass and he was in on it so I'm like trying to appeal to Stanerman I thought okay cool thank god there's someone else on the room it's not just me and Black Eagle I hate it when it's like that I like it when there's someone else but you know little did I yeah but I didn't know that you know he was in on it as well how do I fast forward yeah so yeah, that's about that. Uh, you guys got anything else to add? Poet and uh, Haley and um, uh, well, Doctor. Yeah, after after you. Uh, Hello. I went to uh, the Discord channel. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Obviously, after after I put all the uh, messages together in one PDF, um, yeah, realized this has to be a quick job before I realize it. So I mentioned. His realm set for people, Stanerman and um, Black Eagle himself. Mm. And then few people actually um, came back to me. Um, I think, what was it? Let me just go to my Discord. 
Uh, yeah, space. I think he notices some. We said it in quotation some shady shit. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, a, a player called Lady Metal Brew. Um, I won't disclose the majority of said that's uh, gotta be respectful. But uh, yeah, she was saying. Um, like when I was messaging her, and and then I got kicked, but then she's like sent me a screenshot of him, and I read out the screenshot. He going, hey, how are you? And uh, can I ask for a favor? You know I need to pay for this room, right? With a smiley face, could you? I found a way to get free forever. So would you like to help? You'll basically take seven minutes. <laughs> and she was like, oh my god, he's trying it on me. I said, yeah, and she told me some other stories about this guy, and he's he's a nice person. He's a nice person. Basically, he finds out you're a woman. That's it. He'll become attached to you. Oh God. Um, but there's some other dodgy stuff he he, he was do doing as well. But uh, I think that'll be up to her if she wants to disclose that. Um. Yeah, there's another player called I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. K, K E H. Um, I think. Uh. Yeah, he's saying that he noticed some certain drama going going on there as well, uh, but I don't think he tried it on him. Um, sorry. Mm. Yeah, so um, this guy, yeah, and obviously uh, y Yava, um, I mean, you 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 could address the others. Yava Sharp, yeah. So Yava Sharp, oh no, because what happened? Because um, because you blocked me off the Discord channel. And I had recorded this. I needed him to um, uh, share it out. I, I was like, they. I think he kicked off a doctor and a poet from the room, but not off the Discord server. So I quickly rendered the video, uploaded it onto YouTube, and I told uh, the doctor to just share it with everyone on the realm, on uh, Black Eagle's realm, everyone that's on that Discord channel. And that's when uh, Yava Sharp got told us what happened. That him and his girl, they suffered the same, and they left. And they made their own realm, and I showed him the video, and he was like, "Ah, oh, what the f?" And he was telling me some other stories of what happened to other people that he knows, uh, like. And I was like, oh, "Shit!" And then Willow C, Cyan James, same thing with him. He was like, "Oh, he was shocked. He, he didn't realize he was doing this, stealing other people's accounts." Uh, that sort of shit. That pisses me off. My personal occupation. Yeah, we haven't got time for fees, man. People are stealing. It, it might be a digital. But it's still a product that you paid for, it, you own, you invested time in. Yeah. It's basically a burglar. A yeah, exactly. He's a low level of shitty hacker. Uh, That's why I reported him to uh, Microsoft. Yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, he's yeah, a. And then to become su such a low life as a blackmail to Buka. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Fuck you, mate. You twat. <laughs> I mean, like, bloody criminal. I mean, before it was just a, a, a weird shithead, but that, then he became a blimmin' criminal. And, um, yeah, so... So, yeah, and thankfully, because, and he, you know, the funny thing was, that he wanted to make us famous. Well, thank you, Black Eagle. Our YouTube channel from now, has gone from zero to, well, somewhere, man. That video with you in like what 24 hours, it was 100 views. <laughs> we never had that, <laughs> we never had that before. <laughs> so, okay, uh, so yeah, so uh, don't forget you went to the Minecraft forum. Yeah, I went to every thread that he posted on Minecraft forum. Anyone that responded to that, I messaged them all with the video. And two people responded back, and you know, they suffered the same. And uh, I encouraged people. Please comment on the videos, share the videos. We, I, I just, you know, we've got to stop this person. There's, he's going to do this again and he's still doing it. And he's been doing it for a few years, it seems. Finding out from other people. Um, but the more people know about this, I mean, like, you know, you know, as a gamer to fellow gamers, this is dirty. And especially if there's, like, young kids getting this done to them. I mean, imagine if you're an eight-year-old kid. What the hell is he going to do? Is, not, is he... He can be pressured to not tell his parents who's going to be scared. Oh shit, you know, your account's been taken. What are you going to do? 
you know, what dirty stuff has he done to girls? I mean, f f I dread to think what what sort of how he's blackmailed people on you know through Minecraft. Minecraft, such an innocent, beautiful game. You know, Notch, bloody old man, Notch, Mr. Billionaire, get a hitman on the shit hole. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's, it's giving him game bad name. <laughs> Notched the shit out of this shit. You know, this. Dick, uh, dick, there's a few you know. of them out there like him. Yeah. Like but. Round them up, you see. Yeah. Kick them to the back and shit them. Damn, damn straight. You know, so um, I think that's enough for this video on a uh, Black Eagle, right? So I think I could. Yeah. So uh, if you guys are out there, share it around. Yeah, man. Okay. Um, we just thought it'd be good to show you how I interrupt because he will, when he finds out this is getting out there, um, he will probably close his account and set up a new one. Mm. However, what you can't change is your behavior, the way you talk or you type. Yep. Right? So that way you could uh, really identify someone. So if you see someone who's doing the same thing, and it doing the same thing at least you're now informed now you're aware you can protect yourself that's all it is yeah, yeah. cool all right well can i say one last thing yeah go ahead grow street for life yeah fools yeah. <laughs> 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 all right so if you haven't noticed we're a big gta san andreas fan oh yeah that takes us back oh yeah, that's big time yeah, for you young kids out there that don't know, <laughs> yeah, the best GTA ever. Okay, so shall we call it a cut? And cut.